hydro power plant in hydro electric power plant the potential energy of water due to its high location is converted into electrical energy the total power generation capacity of the power plants depends on the head of the water and volume of the water flowing towards the water turbine it is the most widely used form of renewable energy hydro power plants in himachal pradesh himachal pradesh is extremely rich in its hydro electricity resources about 27436 megawatt of hydro electric power can be generated in the state by the construction of various projects on the five perennial river basins the five snow fed rivers from the himalayas flow within himachal pradesh includes revi chinab satluj bias and yamuna out of the total potential for the state 3783 megawatt has been allotted to the state agents namely hpsebl while 9000 89 megawatt has allotted to the central and ventures while remaining allotted to the private sectors the following table shows the hydroelectric plants and capacity in himachal pradesh hydro power plants in kerala in kerala electricity production depends upon hydel resources the hydro power development in kerala begins with commissioning of palli vasal project in 1940 one of the peculiar assets of the state in the network of river system originating from the western ghats Idukki Hydro Electric Project is the largest electric project in Kerala and capacity of 780 megawatt. The following table shows hydro electric power plants and capacity in Kerala. Thermal power plants in Kerala and Himachal Pradesh. Kerala has 3 thermal power plant stations. There are 5 thermal power plants in Himachal Pradesh. Solar power plant. The energy is available in the form of light and heat from sun. It can be harnessed by PV cells, solar heaters, etc. It is freely available and renewable source of energy. Solar energy can be harnessed directly or for human use. Solar energy is any type of energy is generated by sun. Solar power plants in Himachal Pradesh. Himachal Pradesh have average global horizontal irradiance 5.08 kilowatt hour per meter square per day, which is sufficiently good for electrical energy. Its average global horizontal irradiance is average of monthly global horizontal irradiance of various tehsils and sub tehsils of Himachal Pradesh. Solar radiation above 4.5 kilowatt hour per meter square per day is good for PV, solar water heater, solar cooking. Its solar potential is about 33,840. It is freely available and renewable source of energy. Solar power plant in Himachal Pradesh is commonly seen in Kullu, Chamba, Una, Lahul Spiti, Shimla, etc. Mostly seen solar energy in Himachal Pradesh is Lahul Spiti. Solar power plant in Kerala. Solar power plant are seen in Kerala in Palakkad, Kolkata, Kannur, Malappuram, Wayanad and in Kasaragod. 
The biggest solar power plant in Kerala is Mansuga Sagar in Vayanad. Kerala has anywhere between 130 and 140 megawatt of solar photovoltaic installation which include big ticket projects like Solar Energy Cooperation of India owned 50 megawatt and Cochin Airport is 40 megawatt. Consumption of electricity in Himachal Pradesh It has the owner of providing electricity at the lowest tariff in the country. For 126 to 300 units, consumers will be charged Rs 2.95 per unit and subsidy of Rs 1.90. For 301 and above units, the tariff will be 4.40 with government subsidy of Rs 1.05. For prepaid consumers, the per unit rate will be Rs 2.95. Since the tariff rate is low, electricity is readily available at Himachal Pradesh. Next, Consumption of Electricity in Kerala Take for instance, in Kerala, a household consumes 230 units of energy, then the first 50 units will be charged Rs 3.15 per unit, the next 50 at Rs 3.75, the next 50 at Rs 4.80, then the next 50 at Rs 6.70 and the remaining 30 at 7.60 per unit. As per the present power supply position in the state, Kerala has about 3.35% peak power shortage. The availability of electricity is not regular in many rural parts, but in a majority, electricity is readily available. Uses of Electricity Himachal Pradesh The climate of Himachal Pradesh is cold, hence they do not require appliances such as AC, fans, room coolers at a large scale. But since the climate is cold, they will have use of room heaters and other heating equipments. Since Himajan is filled with the tourist destinations, there are a number of resorts and electricity is used in running resorts and for tourist entertainments. Other than this, electricity is used in factories and domestic activities. Kerala The climate of Kerala is moderate and no two cold but still AC, fans and room coolers are used. Kerala has a large variety of industries, hence electricity is used up for that purposes. There are also a large number of tourist destinations, so resorts are also there. Electricity is also used for domestic and day-to-day -day activities. <laughs>